Um, just to recall that indeed Shore um, is a, a proposal that has been uh, sent to the Council. So it's actually for the Council now to, to adopt it. Uh, technical discussions are ongoing in the Council formations. And as indeed, Jorge, you recalled, the deadline or at least the target that has been fixed by the European Council is to have this instrument ready by the 1st of June. Okay. Um, could you repeat your question on the on the uh, your second question? Sorry. ECB, yes. Uh, uh, whether you believe uh, you consider that the ECB should respond to uh, the demand for clarification because I mean that implies many things that uh, whether the, the German court is I mean could claim those powers to question uh, uh, the ECB uh, authority. No, Jorge, it is definitely not for us uh, to decide uh, or to comment on what the ECB uh, should do in the statement which we issued after the ruling by the German Constitutional Court. We were extremely clear in saying that we have always respected the independence of the ECB in carrying out its functions uh, for, uh, in view of monetary policy and that will definitely not change and therefore we have absolutely no comment to make as to what course of action the ECB should, uh, should take. We reaffirm once again um, that um, in our view there is a primacy of, uh, of EU law and uh, we reaffirm the independence of the ECB in carrying out its functions. Can I ask a follow-up question to Marta, please? Yes, go ahead. Um, so again, on, on the Assure, uh, what do you believe that the 1st of June uh, deadline is feasible? Well, well, again, it's we're at the beginning of May. Uh, discussions in the Council are ongoing. I think they are progressing very well. Um, so the, the target date of 1st of June is, is, is obviously still, still there. So yes, we believe it is still feasible.